Hi, welcome to clickmyproject.com. The project title is 3D Geographic in Large Scale Sensor Networks, a Minimum Network Decomposition Approach. The abstract of this paper is that in the network, the data is to transfer from the source to destination, but the uh, through the shortest path, we use to transfer the data from source to destination. But it, this, this alone does not ensure that whether all the data has been transferred, that is, all the packets has been transferred to the destination. In order to accomplish those methods, we gave, we proposed we proposed a method called using geog GD geographic routing. Instead of finding the shortest path, we used to find the 90 degree A nodes, in which do, based upon the location and the decomposition we used to find the nodes and through that method we used to transfer the data from source to destination so existing of the paper where normal non local non local search 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 in it means that the, we can't guarantee the successful transfer of delivery of messages in the practical network now let me see about the data flow here first of all we have to create one topological environment and based upon that we have to create some components then we have to select some source and destination if the source and destination is, it seems to be uh, same then it is non-GR that is non-geographic routing if it is same if it is not same then we have to select the neighbor nodes based upon the conflict relationship if the particular node doesn't have any conflict relationship then there is no need of validation if it has some conflict relationship we have to go for validation then we have to transfer the data through shortest path now let me see about the process first you need to run frame2.java then you have to click nodes click boundary click group then click source and 3 then click source and 24 source as n4 and 23 click submit click verify whether it is so p is greatly notable region if it is not we have to select for another node then click source node as a 4 click enter here for that we have three neighboring nodes it is 39 see these neighboring nodes are based upon the conflict relationship so it has conflict of 4 then you have to click enter 39 click here here we have enter 22 click conflict so there is there is no conflict relationship so you have to go for another node so there is for that too it doesn't have any conflict relationship so click conflict so it conflicts with 7 so you have to enter 7 click here you have to enter 15 click conflict relationship here it gets conflict you have to click 15 here click 20 so 20 is your so 20 conflicts with 15 so you have to enter 20 here so neighboring node is 4 similarly sync node is 24 click data transfer click browse trans select some data which is going to be transferred from source to destination then click packets it has just as much as 4 click my code and transfer data then go to received run received or java then click receive then file has been completed then click download and click integrity so integrity has been verified there is no packet loss you have to compare the efficiency and time delay efficiency in a sense how much efficient approach it is while using the greedy approach how much efficiency is there and in case of standard approach how much efficiency is there in a sense number of packet loss here it means that in greedy approach there is only 25 packet loss but in standard approach there is about 70 packet loss so so we have we are going to compare the efficiency here then how much time has been calculated for transferring the data from source to destination thank you for listening the process thank you